Hey, could you uh, look something up for me real quick? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Okay. Um, hey, look at this uh, right here. This uh, new camera, the red camera that's coming out. Hey, you're telling me about that. <clears throat> yeah, but they've got one now that can shoot 261 megapixel video, uh, which is just crazy. I, mean, I don't know how you get like a data rate that high, but anyway, like the sensor on them is just enormous. It's I don't know, it's like 10 times the size of anything even remotely close to it. Uh, but I mean, that's gonna be like crazy depth of yeah. field. I don't even know how you would focus. Uh, what'd, you, what'd you want me to look up? Um, how to build a boat in a bottle. Boat in a bottle. Um, we got some authentic models. Boat and message in a bottle. Yeah, um, you can just use the first one probably. How do they work. get the boat in the bottle? A pontoon with a boat. Hold on, I'll just look one up on YouTube. Um, Click on boat that. Boat and a bottle, you uh, YouTube. Okay. That we've got. Um, yeah, like YouTube just started using like an HD compression just a few days ago or something. Yeah. But you can actually do like 720p video, which is pretty cool. I mean, it's a lot better than it used to be, that crappy compressed stuff. Yeah. But it's still not quite, you know, like Vimeo. But these new cameras, um, they've got a $3,000 one that's supposed to be coming Bam. out. It's going to have like a two thirds inch sensor. Um, which, I mean, you can't get something under like 10 Wait, grand for that, that video in a fixed lens. But it should be cool because they've got like a remote that can come with it and you might even be able to like rack focus with the remote. Yeah. And that, that could be really Hang awesome. On, click back on that video. If they do that. I don't know, let me check my email real quick. I think, I think I'm missing it. <clears throat> oh, wait, look at this that I found for my car. Hold on. I found these new shocks. That I can get that are bill that are I mean they're really good. Um, they're $165, which is way cheaper than most of them. Cause like even on eBay you can find them and they're still $400 or something like that. Yeah. Um, but they make these for second generation. But I think I might be able to fit them like retrofit hey. to first gen. Yeah. Yeah. If you, hey, you use click like back on that video real quick though. Yeah, but if you use like the MV top hats, um, then I can still make these fit. Yeah. Um, without really doing that much, yeah. and that'll still yeah. increase the like shock travel in the rear so that I don't bottom out when we yeah. go for shocks. Yeah, click back on that video <clears throat> real and quick. That kind of thing. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. I think this is all in Russian. Right. Yeah. I, I, I bet if you just um, that first yeah, one will work. This one, uh, we got to buy all that stuff that's $12. But there's one already done. I mean you could just do something kind of like that, like bottles, yeah. bottles of fun. I think it's give me a second <clears throat> but like with these cameras when you get like just the two-thirds inch one like the small one it's three thousand dollars you can shoot all the way up to 120 frames per second but if you bump up to a full frame 35 millimeter sensor you can only do 30 frames per second uh, yeah. and that's shooting at 6k which is crazy when these is that like three times like the same camera or something kind of it's it's just like the bigger one but these are uh, a lot higher resolution <laughs> and just to shoot that high is just a whole lot more processing yeah. power and something well i'll just look up that boat like thing later that. i guess uh, yeah but that that's it that's how you build a boat in a bottle